How's it going, ladies and gentlemen? This is Jeff Benjamin with iDownload Blog. You can see I'm running iMovie. This is the new iMovie, of course, and I've imported a slow-mo video from my iPhone 5S, and you can see it's not very slow-mo right now. So how do you fix that in iMovie? It's actually really easy. All you need to do is to enable the high-speed editor. It may already be enabled, but if it isn't, you can right-click and select high-speed editor or use the command R function key. Um, and that will enable the high speed editor. You can drag this little knob here to adjust it or for more precise adjustments, you can double click on the little turtle icon. You have some presets here. Now actually, if you wanna get the true slow-mo mode that's found on the iPhone 5S, you need to use the 25% preset or you can change it as you wish. But the 25% gives you a one-to-one, -one, uh, as you see there, uh, representation of the slow-mo video that appears on your iPhone 5S or in your Finder when you do a preview. So this is how you do it, folks. It's super easy to do so in iMovie. And really, the same thing applies to any movie application on the Mac. All you need to do, for instance, if you're using Final Cut Pro 10, all you need to do is just slow down the video because it's already at a very high rate of speed. You still maintain all your quality settings, and that will allow you to get your true slow motion that, you, that you're looking for. So hopefully, this was able to help you out. If you're running iMovie, it's super easy to represent your slow-mo videos right there in the editor view. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. This is Jeff with iDownloadBlog.